What's up everyone? This is Bill with Android Related Stuff. Today what you are looking at is the Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 edition from Samsung. And what I'm going to talk to you about today is, and this goes for any Galaxy Note device. Uh, there's an app out there that I don't think a lot of people know about it. At least I couldn't find any information on the internet or anything to add apps to my split screen or multi window or to add apps to the pen window. I could not find an app that would do that without having root access. This tablet is running stock Android 4.3 Jelly Bean and it is right out of the box. It is not rooted and you can add whatever app you want if it's not a system app. Now for example in the pen window you do not get the Chrome the Chrome browser. You see here, you get their in Samsung's internet browser. That's what you get. So, and since it's already installed on the device, you cannot get the Chrome browser in there because this cannot write to the system apps. I've already tried it and that's what it told me. So basically, Let's take a look at the app. Here it is in the Google Play Store. The app itself is free. The Pro version, which lets you do everything you're going to want to do, is $2.49, I believe. And uh, I bought the Pro version. So for when downloading the free app, it will ask you, when it, when it prompts you to download the Pro version, it will give you a link to take you to the Pro version. You can see MW Pen App Enable or Pro Key, which I have purchased. So I'll show you real quick how it works. You're going to open up the pen window or the uh, MW pen app enabler. Okay, you're going to open it and it says pick an installed app or pick an app from an SD card, which would be like your APK files that are side loaded, stuff like that. Okay, so we're going to pick an installed app. What I've done is downloaded the Chrome Beta browser. So there you see Chrome Beta. This way I can have a Chrome browser in my. Uh, pen window it's already comes stock you already have access to the Chrome browser in your multi window but not in the pen window which I disagree with so we're gonna go pen window and it says multi window and for example I already have like uh, the Amazon App Store WordPress Philips Hue lighting system I have that in split screen or multi window and I have that in my S pen uh, window so there you go we got the chrome beta and pen window enabled and then we're going to go process and we'll see how this works out again this is without rooting your device and the bigger the app the longer it takes this app's got a few megabytes to do so it's going to take a second And in the in the description below this video, I will put a link to my webpage, which talks a little more about it. And it'll also have a link to the Google Play Store to go download the app. So you can go check it out there. And uh, don't forget to follow us on Android-related stuff on Google+. Okay, app is currently installed. Please uninstall and then reinstall using the button below. So we're going to uninstall. Chrome Beta will be uninstalled. Basically what this does is it rewrites the path that shows where it's installed on your device. So we're going to install. Okay, It's going to prompt us to install down at the bottom. So now we're going to install and it's going to be in the pen window. If everything works right. And this is without rooting your device. Okay, we're done. So we'll close the app and we'll try it out. So now we should have Chrome browser in pen window. Oh, I guess I gotta draw a window. There you go, Chrome beta. 
We'll hit no thanks for now. So you can see there, everything working. Zoom in and out, pinch to zoom. You got your multiple tabs up there. And so now you have a Chrome browser in your pen window with everything working fine in the background. Okay, and then I'll show you the other example here, Amazon App Store. You can't get that in split screen unless you're using an app to do it. And don't forget to check out Amazon App Store. Today's free app is uh, Riptide GP2. And then let's go with the Philips Hue lighting system. We got the house wired with this, with the Philips Hue lighting system. So now you have that. As you can see, the lights just changed. Go back to sunset here. So there's the Philips Hue lighting system and the Amazon App Store working side by side in multi-window. And this is without rooting your device. So anyways, there'll be a link in the description. Go to my webpage and click on the link in the webpage. You'll be able to see some screenshots that I've shared there on how to, how to do this. I talk a little more about it. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this was helpful. Uh, again, I haven't seen a lot of stuff like this out there on how to do it without rooting your device. So please uh, reshare the information and put it out there. That's why I'm putting this video out. Go check us out on AndroidRelatedStuff.com. And uh, that's my website. And then Android Related Stuff on Google+. And I also have a Galaxy Note Related Stuff uh, Google Plus community as well. So look me up there as well. Anyway, this is Bill Ramsier with Android Related Stuff. Have a good day.